See what I mean? She won't jump out. I can leave it open for days. Yeah, she's just she just likes sitting there. Yeah, she's pretty awesome. Oh, in Alabama. Everybody to a fourth of the fourth of the fourth of July vlog from Spicer, Minnesota, on a gloomy kind of rainy, windy, breezy, blustery, a Winnie the Pooh type day, right? Look at her. Look at her. It, it, she knows it. She's like Piglet, though. She just what? Oh, you don't like being on camera now? She likes it. I raced to get up here as fast as I could. Not, not for the 4th of July celebration, but because I was figuring that I could get unloaded today. Yeah, I know it's the 4th of July, I know it's a holiday, but my company told me, hey, if you get there before 4 o'clock in the afternoon, they'll unload you, and then we got a loaded trailer sitting over in St. Paul you could pick up and take to Chicago for tomorrow morning. So I figured, all right, I could work and make some money throughout the holidays and not have to worry about the scales being open and traffic and everything else. Nope, I get here. They're closed. The only thing going on is a little fruit stand out front that, I mean, but he can't unload me. He's, he's out there selling fruit. But as I was walking back to my truck, something amazing happened. Something incredible. The reason I love small town America. Not only because they like kitty cats, because of their generosity and kindness. Look, look at her sitting there. So I was walking back to my truck. Somebody from the parking lot here at this little shopping gas station area, they walked over, offered to take me home. They're getting ready to do a barbecue. Wanted to take me to enjoy a family feast with their family and then go out to the lake, one of the largest lakes in the state of Minnesota, which is about a mile from here, I guess, that has the largest display of fireworks in the entire state. Go enjoy barbecue with them. Go enjoy some fireworks. They bring me back to the truck, and I said, "No, no, you know that's okay. I can, if it's only a mile away, I can, I can hoof it on down there and, and capture, capture the fireworks." And they go, "Well, how about this? I have an extra vehicle. Why don't you borrow my pickup truck for the night, and then in the morning when you're all done, just leave the keys in it and park it right here along this building, and I'll send my wife over to grab it in the morning." I, people uh, up here, I, I, it's not up here specifically it's pretty much across all of america sometimes you get really depressed because of the political atmosphere and people being one way or the other you know and uh and i tend to go one way over the other but it doesn't mean that we can't all get along and it's just days like this and you meet people like this it just makes you realize you know what no matter what's going on in the world, no matter what's going on in the country, no matter who's in office, we, the people, we can be good to each other. And it's people like that that, that make you proud, not only to be an American, but just to be a human. I mean, I have no idea what I'm actually saying. It's just, it makes you feel good when people are actually nice. They, it's that karma thing. Do good things, good things happen. I used to watch My Name is Earl. Plan is probably to walk to the end of this parking lot as the sun starts going down, avoid the crowds of Minnesotans, I think they're called Minnesotans, and just get to the end of that parking lot. I want to fly my drone through some fireworks. Thinking about going inside the truck, making a couple peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, maybe eat some potato salad with that charge up the drone batteries and uh, yeah do something that Disney won't let you do that you can't fly a drone through Disney fireworks how amazing would that be though you can't do it but if I launch from here and take it up over 400 feet high and look down on the fireworks as they're coming up I, I think that could be some pretty good photograph opportunities and 
great video for the vlog celebrating America's independence. All right, the next time you see me, we'll be in the next vlog. I think I'm gonna go ahead, end it here, and show you guys a firework spectacular like the world has never seen from Spicer, Minnesota. I love you guys. Happy 4th of July. Peace. I'm sorry guys, I can't put the fireworks on there. They're making me leave here, so I'm I'm not gonna be able to record any fireworks. I gotta I gotta go. Maybe when I get to Disney on the 16th. Until then, peace out everybody.